Hi there Commanders, Guardian E here with another Azure Lane video and here we have the cataclysmic clash of two top heavy franchises. The Senran Kagura collaboration with Azure Lane is live day one on Thanksgiving Day. Happy Turkey Day to all of you out there in America um, and happy Thursday to everybody else out there across the globe. We're going to be going in on day one to try to sweep this banner and try to get all of these lovely Kunoichi. And, of course, they are dropping a lovely batch of skins alongside the collaboration event. We'll be taking a closer look at those and reviewing those in an upcoming video in a couple of days. Today's just about the polls, but do be on the lookout for that. As always, if you do enjoy this type of content and you would like to help support the channel, please consider leaving a like, commenting down below, subscribing to the channel for more. It really, really does help us out. We really do appreciate it. And if not, thank you so, so much just for checking out the video, checking out the channel, and coming along with us. So let's go ahead and hit that banner. All right, so here we are on the limited time rate of banner starting today and ending on December 6th. So about two full weeks uh, to pull for these ladies and grind through the event itself. You can see the rate up ships all available here. So Asuka, Yumi, and Fubuki are all going to be on rate up. Ikaruga is going to be at the 0.5%, right? Yes, the 0.5% because you can't acquire her for free just by grinding the event from the event shop or as a map drop as well. Uh, but you can get her as, as a non rate up at 0.5%. And then Yuyaki, as the elite on rate up, is going to be at the standard 2.5%. There is, of course, Homura as well as Murasaki. Murasaki you can acquire for free just by grinding and going through the milestone rewards. There's a little side mini event for copies of Homura, so you are able to get her for free as well. So out of the, all the ships, you're able to get three of them just by grinding naturally, and the rest we're going to be pulling for here today, of course. So, so I got some light dailies lined up here. We're just going to run through these real quick, see if there are any omens of things to come. Uh, over the past week or so, and <laughs> oh man, Taiho Muse, always love to see Taiho, so that is, that's fine by me. Maybe a good sign of things to come, maybe, uh, she might be, a, you know, she's on the possessive side, so, so maybe she's gonna, uh, oh, Gloucester too. <laughs> uh, maybe she'll scare away some of the other, oh wow, and Agram as well, wow, so okay, two golds, uh, in the last set of, uh, dailies. I hope I didn't use up all of my gold luck on these, but uh, it's it's definitely nice to see some gold, that's for sure. All right, let's get it going. First 10 pull on the event banner. Use our quick finishers and get it rolling. So Senron Kagura collaboration finally here. Honestly, a little surreal. Uh, I've been a fan of Senron Kagura. Really? Oh, Asuka, yes! Just gotta say you're a fan, and her wholesome smile will show up to meet you. That is awesome. Starting things out with an Asuka right away. That's great. The original face of the series uh, definitely holds a special place in our hearts. So, hello, I'm Asuka, second year student at the Hanzo Academy. Wait, this isn't the new Shinobi base at all. This place is your port, you say? Okay then, well, no matter where I end up, I'll always train as best I can. Always got that infectious enthusiasm, Asuka here, that is great. I uh, love the redesign, I love the art style that they have for the Senran Kagura girls. Uh, it, it's really, really lovely. I don't know how we, uh, I haven't looked into how we go through, because they have damaged art for the, um, the, the original art too, so I'm not exactly sure how that happens, if you have to like tap or swipe or, uh, or maybe it's just like, as they take damage. I'm not entirely... We'll, we'll take a closer look a little bit later, but that's great. Starting with an Asuka is amazing. So like I said, I've been a fan of Senran Kagura since the beginning uh, on the 3DS. That title way, way back when. I, I, I kind of tapered off like around the time of like Peach Beach Splash, I think, when that came out, but I followed it pretty, pretty closely early on. And it's been... I mean, it's been... You know, tapered off right now. It's the mobile game that's the current collaboration, really, with, with New Link. Um, but yeah, it's... It, I actually, oh yes, Yuyaki as well, okay, getting at least one event ship per multi, I am totally okay with that, getting the purple, she is absolutely amazing looking, <laughs> beautiful design, uh, look at the wing, the, the winged rigging behind her too, it's so cool, it has like some scopes and stuff on the side, really neat, and she's kind of perched on this branch with these ravens, really great stuff, so no elusive elites today, thankfully, 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 uh, my name is Yuyaki, and I'm the leader of the Tono Tengu Shinobi group. To be honest, I'm not great around water. Bad things always happen when I'm around it. And this place is a whole ocean, right? What should I do? <laughs> so, seems like she's a little timid around the ocean. Uh, so she might she might be a little worse for wear in uh, in our dock, but that's okay. I'm sure she'll learn to appreciate it. Got plenty of ship girls to help her out. That is great. 
So yeah, Senron Kagura has been around for a while. Oh, another Asuga. We will take those. We take dupes. We take dupes just fine. That is A-OK -okay by me. Absolutely lovely. That's great. I was just checking out the uh, the Senron Kagura official page, and it, it I think they're celebrating their 10th anniversary. So it's been, you know, 10 years strong. I would love to see, like, a new mainline title for Senron Kagura. Uh in the future. I mean, they might have to replatform because of Sony. I, I think, and I think certainly they could just go the PC route, like, these days. Like, way back when Senran Kaga first came out, um, Japan wasn't, like, too in. And back when Senran Kaga first came out, like, console was really the way in Japan. But these days, they've really adopted the PC. So, <laughs> getting a Zeppi. <laughs> a Zep John, that's fine. Uh, so they could definitely just go, like, I feel like they could go PC exclusive and like, honestly clean up if they, if they decided to. Um, so, oh, speaking of which, I know that the Steam sale is going on. Black Friday is going to get going on, basically. Deals everywhere. Uh, and so, yeah, I'm hunting some, hunting some deals. The Steam sale is, is going on. And so all of the Senran Kagura titles on Steam are also available. <laughs> yes, nice. All right, Yumi making an appearance. It, I think the uh, unofficially the the second face of the series, Yumi, incredibly popular character. Uh, just when she made her her uh, debut, she kind of like took the series by storm, and she's very very lovely, and uh, there's a good reason for it, right? So uh, I am Yumi, third year student at the Guessing Girls Academy. Though I know why I was brought here, I am committed to justice, no matter where I go. Yeah, I remember that Yumi is uh, is justice this and justice that. She's all about her own form of justice. And, uh, fantastic. So that is great, getting our Yumi as well. Very, very happy about that. Yeah, so I'm, uh... I have most of the Senran Kagura titles on Steam, so I, I think there's just a couple of stragglers. I'm probably gonna pick those up during the, uh, during the sale and everything. But yeah, if you're interested in, like, you know, pretty, pretty compelling visual novel storytelling and, like, uh, 3D action. I think Peach Beach Splash was actually like a third-person shooter as well. Another Asuka? That's fine. I guess she was a little mad about uh, me saying that Yumi was like kind of the second face of the series. Asuka, you're still you're still the face to me. Shanghai. Here we go. Can we get another? Getting more Asukas is nice though. U96. Uh, okay, so I think this is our first. A non rate up gold, that is, that's fine, it's bound to happen, it's bound to happen. Next 10 pull in! Now, at this point, we are just really missing the Fubuki out of the banner only ship, so that's really uh, who we want to make sure we get before we walk away today. A <laughs> unicorn, alright. U73. Okay, Suffolk, Ranger, Ranger, double Ranger, huh? Double RNG -er. Oh no, is this going to be the first multi with no event ships? Oh no! Alright, well hopefully that's not the beginning of the end here. Uh, we got lots of cubes ready. Also, yeah, if you, I know people are kind of short on cubes because of Shimakaze right before this. We're going to have another UR before the end of the year too. Remember, you know, you got plenty of time to farm uh, and, and just grind commissions, try to get your cube counts up. Stick to your dailies three per day during events to really maximize your cube potential. Double Suffolk here. <laughs> and remember, we do have the Commission Exchange. So in addition to the cubes that you get through the commissions, naturally, the Commission Exchange gives you, like, what? Like, 60 extra cubes or something like that? So it's pretty... It's pretty awesome. Um, oh, no! That was two dead multis in a row. You hate to see it. Ooh, hopefully not... Hopefully not a sign of things. Come on. I know the Shinobi are... The Kunoichi are uh, sneaky, but I would like Fabuki to cut us a little bit of slack here. I certainly would not say no to an Ikaruga as well. But we are hoping... Another double rng -er? Is that like a sign of, uh... Oh. <laughs> okay. Well, we got a gold at least. It's, it's formidable. It's, uh... It's formidable. <laughs> That's fine. Alright. Keep it moving, keep it moving. Uh, so even after... Whatever we do today, I'm still going to do dailies on the event to get uh, to help out with the event currency. So we'll we'll see. I mean, I, I'm not. I don't want to jinx myself. I, I do want to get. Uh, okay. All right, Yumi. Another copy of Yumi is is a okay. That is totally fine. But once again, we are hunting that Fubuki at the two percent. Let's see if she can come home. So we're gonna let's skip this one. 
finish all. And we're going to skip. See if that nets us any better luck. Skip! A <laughs> cocky chan. <laughs> Alright. Oh no! Not about that life. Not about it. Let's skip <laughs> another Yumi. So we're three three apiece. You got a three piece of Yumi and three piece of Asuka. Quite a tasty meal, but uh okay, skip and nothing. Dang. Alright, next ten pull. Um that being said, um uh you know, it just takes one. We 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 just need one Fubuki here. I skipped the last couple, so I'm let, let <laughs> well, let's let's slow play this one a little bit more. Come on, Albacore Muse. What? What the heck? You know, we've only gotten one Yuyaki as well, which is ah uh, no event ships. Dang man, feels bad. Okay, it's starting to get a little grim. Not gonna lie, but I, I, I've got, uh, but I do, of course, have the cubes to spend. Naturally, we only need 400, you know, for the next UR. As far as like guaranteeing a copy, another Yumi. Okay. Uh, okay, another Yuyaki. Oh, all right. So it's starting to, the faucet's starting to turn back on as far as the event ships go. Definitely pleased about that. Ah, you five five six. Okay, all right, all right. At least we're not getting dead multis, but definitely not uh not coming up strong on the Fubuki or the Ikaruga. I really hope we can make it happen. Nautilus, all right. Nautilus for the longest while was like the single ship that I was missing. Another Asuka. Okay, all right. Come on, Asuka. Let's 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 bring Fubuki along. I know she's kind of. You know, the mobile counterpart, not not an OG character. Yuyaki as well, hello. Um, but let's kinda let's 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 leave some room for her, please. I would like her to make an appearance today if possible. Let's go into the next one here. And let her rip. Come on, please. Please. Now I do believe that Yuyaki and Fubuki are both uh the mobile game characters, like they, they made their debut in the mobile games, uh, but both are quite popular as I understand it. All right, so <laughs> trying to be thankful here at Thanksgiving. Cut me some slack. So I think this is going to be like 300 cubes in, something like that. Arc Royal, another Yuyaki. Yeah. Anything else to write home about? Indie, Indie Chan. Not quite. Not exactly what we're looking for here. Another Yumi. Oh man! Wow, Fubuki being super elusive today. What's the deal? Fubuki is playing some games. I don't know. I don't know. I at some point we're gonna have to slow it down. And uh, <laughs> Nausicaa too. Asuka and Yumi are double teaming me, which is fine by me. But we would like to get Fubuki into the mix too here. Like even though I have a lot of cubes, it's not like I want to burn them all here <laughs> if possible. But the thing is, that's the thing about collaboration units. You don't know, they're not going to potentially, you never know if they're going to get a rerun. And uh, there's no pity. All right, so my storage got filled mid-multi, so unfortunately I cut off, but I didn't get anything so far out of this multi. We've only got two left in here. Uh, so let's see who who's here. Nobody. <laughs> Nobody of value. All right, so I checked. We're like 340 cubes deep. I think I'm willing to go maybe three more multis, and that's it for day one. Um, look, it happens. It happens. I was hoping we wouldn't get, you know, one ship that just decides to be a little difficult today. But look, we've got... Oh, there's Ikaruga. Okay, so you know what? It really is one ship that's being difficult. Uh, we are getting Ikaruga, the 0.5% ship. Uh, and she looks lovely here. We're going to... Uh, that saves us a little bit of grind, too, which means that maybe I can skip out on some of the daily pulls that I would be doing normally. But um, I am Ikaruga, a third-year student at the Hanzo National Academy, serving as the Shinobi class representative. How should I conduct myself in this foreign place? I would be most grateful if you would provide me with your assistance. So, very prim, proper, ladylike classically uh, beautiful Japanese girl, and then we're gonna... <laughs> okay, that's fine. Two more multis! Two more multis before we end things today. Can we clutch it out? Can we clutch things out? We're just missing Fubuki at this point. Would be rather... Would be nice to get our Fubuki today. 
but if we don't, I'm not gonna sweat it too hard. We've got our dailies to, to fall back on. We got a, we're getting a lot of subs today, too, interestingly enough. Awful lot of subs. All right, last chance, last dance. Let's see if we can make some magic happen. Some ninpo happen. Some ninja magic, maybe. Can we? Can we get something? Not Yorktown. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, Yumi, please. Yumi, please. Oh, wow. This is uh, another Yuyaki as well. Okay. Man, Fubuki is being she's being a little difficult. Alright, well you know what that we're calling that today. Day one, that's where we're gonna end things, I think. Again, I'm gonna do my daily pulls on the event, uh, and then we'll do a wrap-up at towards the towards the end of the event where we'll reveal the dailies, uh, see if we have to go in any deeper for Fubuki. Hopefully not, but uh, we'll see what RNG has in store for us. But yeah, that's what we're gonna call things. Unfortunately, we're not, we weren't able to get the day one sweep. We gotta, we gotta fall back, fall back a little bit. But again, the event is still young. We got plenty of time, so I'm not fretting, and you shouldn't fret either if your day one didn't go very well. But hopefully, that means that everybody else did amazingly out there. Let me know down below in the comments how your polls went. Now remember that we are going to do a skin showcase and overview as well in a couple of days to go over the skins that dropped with this collaboration. So if you're interested in that, do make sure to subscribe so you get notified when that goes live, but that should be fun. Uh, hopefully you all enjoyed the video. If you did, please feel free to leave us a like, comment, subscribe to the channel for more Azure Lane content. We thank you all so much for watching, for taking time out of your day to spend with us. We really do appreciate it. And until next time, let's protect those waters.